Hey everybody, so I'm back off my trip, man. So it's been a long, it was a long drive. Still pretty tired actually from it, so I'm doing overhead press workout today. I'm not sure how heavy I'm gonna go, but uh, I always put good effort in, man. So it's a little bit cool out here. It's plus one right now, plus two degrees, and this is Saturday afternoon. So I'm gonna set up these weights. I'm gonna start with 135. I'm not sure if I'm going to use this belt or not yet, but uh, for my first sets, I'm not going to. I'm just starting with 135. It's going to be my first lift of the day. I haven't lifted since uh, the 10th of December. The barbell, anyway. I've done, uh, you know, light dumbbell work and stuff. So. That's not the same. Barbell's cold on the hands, so you gotta warm it up, transfer heat. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna do a couple sets of uh, 135 just to get the flow for it. I haven't done this in a bit. This is the first exercise I go back to though, because it's my favorite pretty well. three now I'm gonna raise it 20 pounds okay so right now I got 155 on there I'm just gonna do you know two to three reps nice just to move up in the weight a little bit this is how I do it and then I rep it out things after man for high reps I'm just going for the blood flow now just to get it back I'm gonna start going heavier in the weight now this is just a temporary spot just to work out but I kind of like it actually Alright, I gotta put some more weight on it. I really gotta try on these, holy. Okay, so right now I got 175 on the bar. It's just going up a little lightly just to get the blood flow back. I got no belt on, I got my uh, Heli Hansen boots on. Alright, so these boots are, they boost me up about an inch or so, maybe two. So it makes it a little bit different. We'll do another quick set of 175. See how that feels. Now these low reppers, even if I go one, it's just for power, man. That's all. You know what I mean? Yeah, it feels heavy today, guys. I'm gonna get these back. Whew. Okay, I'm gonna put on 10 more pounds. That's gonna bring it to 185. I'm really gonna have to try for this one, I know it. I'm gonna have to power it up, man. Not push press, but I'm gonna have to use my body, man, to put this up. Gotta give a little breather. Okay, this is 185 pounds, no belt. It's gonna be hard for me right now, man, to be honest with you guys. You know, I haven't really done it. I gotta go, ooh, I've been lazy, man, just driving around, a little stiff everywhere. 
haven't been doing any cardio lately, so, you know, I gotta work back the lungs, man. I'm gonna get in some lighter rep work. So I can't really go much heavier than that without really pushing my body, man. It's, it's pretty strict, man. So, whew. That's my favorite, man. That's the, wor that's the hardest fucking one, man. You know, just cause you guys can bench over 300. I don't know if you guys can do that, man. 185. At 205 pounds body weight, 185. Just a nice strict press, you know what I mean? Right over. Backwards, over behind the head too. Not just uh, with the hold. You know what I mean? It's very hard right now for me, man. But I'm gonna start moving up in the weight. Next time I'm gonna go five pounds more because I got these little 190s. Got these little two and a half that bring it up to 190. So I'll do that next time, right? Five pounds and then I'll start moving up from there. My next set is a 205 where I can do the 205 really strict though, you know? It's, it's hard, man, you know what I mean? All right, guys, I'm going to do some rep work on this one. So I'm going to pause this. Feels warmer out now to you once I get moving. So this is just 135. I'm going to see how many I can get comfortably. I should try to get, um, I'm going to do a set, a good number set, and then move up in the weight a little bit and just keep going a little bit like that. Just try to do some rep work with lighter weight. Even the 185 was hard for me today, guys. So this is the first one I, st I start on. Tomorrow I'll do a different workout. On Monday I'm back to the bricks, residential guys. So I'm doing videos on that, on this same channel. So next time I do this workout, I'm going to go 10 reps on that instead of 8. I'll improve it by 5 pounds and 2 reps on this. Okay. Now I'm going to go up in the weight a little bit and tr see how many I can get again. Without grinding too hard. Well, I'm grinding hard, man. It's hard as I can, believe it or not. Without using my back too much. So I just added 10 pounds. So I got, instead of 135, 145. Because I want to do some muscle damage work. Alright. I already did my power ones. So now I gotta do some muscle damage so I can get some growth, man. That's what I want, man. A little bit of muscle growth now. I got a lot of calories in me. I've been sitting around. Shit. Motherfucker. I got the five pounds. That sucks. You can really feel it, I had five pounds difference, man. As soon as you pick it up, it's crazy. Fuck. It's like, what the fuck? All right. Fucking good bench setup. Hey, look at this fucking little rack, man. I can fit this in a closet. It's unbelievable. I'm lucky with this one. Thank you, God. You give me this. Do a couple push presses with it. Get that extra oomph. Oh yeah, man. 
That's when you do fucking push press right at the end. You fucking feel it everywhere. No matter how heavy your leg is. Whew. Now I got to up it to 155. Okay, we'll go 155 now. Push this press is probably only give me like two, three more reps max with that. Fuck man. Try that at the end just to push press, man. They work. Whoo! Gives you that extra fucking damage for the shoulders and the triceps on the top. Whoo! Fuck yeah. You know guys, I say if there's if there's if this is the only exercise that you ever did, man, you'd stay fucking strong your whole body. Especially if you clean it off the ground, right? The overhead press. Clean it off the ground, you get your forearm work, to clean your legs. Strict press, then push press. That's the only exercise that a man really fucking needs, I'll tell you that, man. All the rest, it just uh, it makes you bigger and bigger, which you know a lot of people want. I'm just going for normal, 210, 215 pounds. You know, six foot, six one. That's what I'm going for, 215 at the max, 217. All right, I don't want to go over the 220 mark. And my goal is to compete in the strict press next year, right, at 48 years old. That's what my goal is, man, and the strict press. So I'm going to get it up big time. And right now, this is two, 165. All right, with this 165, I'm really going to have to try as well. Everything is not easy, man. I don't care. I feel that in the back too, the upper back, man. Whoo, holy shit. When you really fucking do it. Whew. All right, guys. Feel a little warmer now. I don't know, did I lose any size? I haven't really worked out. I don't think my arms did. I haven't measured them yet. But I'm just working my shoulders right now. I haven't done any kind of pump work for the arms. So now what I do, I do reverse grip overhead press just a few sets man these are good i'm gonna start adding more of these into my routine i used to do them and i have been doing them lately last time well before i took my little break fucking driving i'm probably gonna drive back again too soon guys i do that all the fucking time man i go out west and back man it's hilarious all right so reverse 135 hard right now. I'm going to stick with this weight. Okay, so I just uh, rest for a couple minutes. No big deal. See, man, you got to do the kickbacks with the dumbbells. That's what gives you those fucking short, those triceps like that, man. I'm telling you guys. There's no other way, man. Kickbacks. You know what kickbacks are? I didn't really do too many of them. Working out, I did a lot of biceps. But you take a little lightweight like this. 
You go like that, see? Watch. Just like that. Just nice. See, you can always twist too. So you twist just like a bicep move, right? Because the arm naturally wants to go that way. So you just do whatever the arm does naturally. See? It works with triceps. I do lots of these. It smells like metal now. Fucking right. I'm gonna take them off the ground and put them on top of something on my dumbbells and on my weights. Just make sure they stay nice and tarped up because it stays damp in here. Let's have something to dry it out. I don't know. But it smells better. It smells like iron, right? Like blood. You know, that's why I say blood in the fucking gym, right? Okay, now another reverse grip. So I try to stay a little bit in compared to the uh, the regular overhead press. Now I gotta warm this up, this exercise. The bar is warming up now actually too. I can add maybe five pounds, ten pounds, but I'm just gonna stay at this weight. So I gotta move the camera if I do that. I'll do another set, another two sets of that. Tomorrow I'm going to do some incline bench press, flat bench, and then curls. And then some more tricep workout. Maybe a few sets of squats, actually, too. I've got to change my workout routine because going back to the residential, I'm going to feel it in my back, too, from doing a lot of different work. Like a little, a lot of, it's a lot different, man. Got to be more agile. I got to go in, like, different spots. Man, it's going to be, it's going to be tough. You guys will see, man. I'll show you guys what it's like to build, uh, brick a whole house, man. Depends where I, they're supposed to start a new house on Monday, so you know I'm gonna try to film as much as I can of the full from start to finish. I'm not gonna go on too much other people's work though or nothing. It's not a roast or nothing. You know what I mean? I'm just there to work and have have a good time at work actually, man. To make fucking thousand bucks a week, man. That's the way it is. All right, guys. Reverse grip. Overhead press. One more set of this, and then I'm done for the day. And tomorrow I'll do another workout. I don't want to fucking kill it today. I just want to stimulate it very, very well. Man, it feels good. I fucking miss that feeling. Now I'm breathing clear again. Fuck, I got the blood flow going back. That's not even pumped up, guys. That's just normal warmth, man. It's fucking only plus one out here. It's gonna be like minus minus three tonight or something. So it does at night here and then it warms up during the day. Sometimes we get the bad fucking cold though, but only lasts, man. Like one month of one month of fucking year, man. That's it. Hasn't even started yet. Right? In Victoria, it's pouring fucking rain right now, my girlfriend says. All fucking day, you know? And that sucks, man. You know what I mean? All the time rain. Fucking pain in the ass last year, man. Last year was I was lucky, man. I had work all year round in there, man. But this year, if they want me to do chimneys outside, do cement fucking shit, man, they're all out there in the fucking mud. I ain't fucking doing that shit. All right, one more set of this. Yeah, I'm not working in the mud for the same fucking money, man. That's the way it is. You know, I don't have to do that here, man. Here I just go and it's all tarped up. I'm working indoors in the heat. Fuck. Sometimes outside, you know, whatever. Alright guys, this is the last set of fucking uh, reverse grip. <sighs> Take a deep breath. I bring it right to the chest, right off the chest, man. All my all my presses. Nothing up here or halfway. Sometimes I go lower just to fucking get that extra fucking pull, that fucking stretch. Alright guys, one last set. Let's see if I can get over three, or three at least.
right, one more. One more. All right, guys. Press like and subscribe on this one, please. Fucking smash it! Fuck. That's what I do. You fucking smash everything. I press like on everybody's videos I watch, just to be honest with you. <laughs> Peace, guys. Till next time. Thanks for watching. You know, feels good to fucking be back working out, man. It's only been like fucking nine days, so that's nothing. Bye-bye.